Hey, Daniel. Hey, Addison. How are you today? Fine. How are you? I'm doing really well. That's right. Looking forward to this conversation. Yeah. So, Daniel, we've talked a lot, you and I, about something called acupuncture. What is acupuncture, Daniel? Acupuncture basically believes there are many meridian points over the body in a human being. And by using needles or some other means to stimulate meridian points, it could regulate the energy and the blood flow inside the body and heal a person. That is acupuncture. Thank you, Daniel. So have you used acupuncture? Yes. Without acupuncture, I would not be where I am today. I was very skeptical at the beginning. However, seeing the results, I had to be a believer. So what kind of things were changed for you using acupuncture, Daniel? So when I first was released from hospital, I had a really difficult time to regulate my saliva. So my phlegm was out of control. The first night I spent at home, my mom came to help me, and she gave a full box of Kleenex and put a plastic sheet right next to my bed and said, if you need to spit something up, put it in the Kleenex, throw it in the sheet, next morning I will collect it. My night over, after I woke up, she found the full Kleenex was gone. The plastic sheet was littered with hundreds of pieces of little clinics I pulled out in the night to wipe out my front. It was that bad. Neil, my friend, introduced me to this acupuncture doctor, Dr. Amy Sung. She looked at me the first visit and said, we need to do something to control our phlegm. Let's try to control it in two weeks. I was like, is it really possible? In two sessions, she pretty much eliminated all the extra flat. I remember after the second session that night, I did not use one single piece of Kleenex. And my mom woke up in the morning, looked at the plastic sheet. She was like, I could not believe it. That was the moment everyone in my house saw the hope. There's something can be done very effectively to remove the symptoms on you one by one. Okay, Daniel, that's a wonderful story. And I'm really happy that that particular treatment was so successful for you. I understand for myself and from other people that acupuncture is highly effective. And sometimes for some conditions, it takes longer or acupuncture isn't actually the right treatment. Can you speak to that? Sure. Addison, you raised a very good point. Acupuncture is not for everything. So for example, let's say if I got an infection or I injured my foot, maybe not using acupuncture, maybe some other ways can heal it faster. And the other thing is, I did get my phlegm under control in two weeks. However, other symptoms took a lot longer. When you pick an acupuncture doctor, you should always think about the commute. Because for something like stroke, if you really want to see some results, maybe you should keep going at least once a week for about two months. Cumulatively, at least budget two months. Each week, you visit twice or three times would be ideal. Daniel, thank you for that understanding that acupuncture is going to be a different experience for everybody and that it's really very wonderful advice that we get the most expert opinion from our doctors, whoever they are, that we can and that we then take responsibility for understanding what we need to do with that advice. So I'm going to ask you about acupuncture doctors. Are they all the same? And if not, how do you pick one? They're not, and the one thing I would advise people to 
pick, when you are picking an acupuncture doctor, have a good interview with the person. Do not look at the acupuncture doctor as, oh, acupuncture comes from China, so a Chinese doctor must be better than everybody else. It's not true. Look at the person's training, the practice, the record. And then very important thing is when you are having a conversation, first conversation with the acupuncture doctor, try to see if that doctor understands neurology, anatomy well enough to give a reasonable explanation as to how his or her treatment can help you. Because if the doctor says, well, the energy flows, the stars line up, maybe you shouldn't look somewhere else. When the doctor says, well, if you pressure the meridian points, it will increase the blood flow. And when the blood flow increases, your muscle will loosen up. Congratulations. Maybe you got the right person. And one thing to keep in mind is acupuncture when it comes to treatment, is it can be applied to a multitude of things. So simply an acupuncture doctor gets a very high review. is not good enough. You need to read what they are good for. 